We are so excited to announce the new CSTA virtual community. It is an online discussion group just for CSTA members to help you connect, engage, and learn with other CS advocates. It is different than other online platforms because CSTA is different. Our programming and resources are integrated with this community so you can find resources, get advice, and connect with other teachers all over the world. You can expect to find resources, teaching lessons, and connect with other teachers, ask questions about classroom challenges, follow up with speakers and presenters after events, learn about activities and successes in grade band groups. The CSTA virtual community is live now, and depending on the information you've shared in your CSTA profile, you've been automatically placed into community groups. There are two ways you can access the CSTA community through the member dashboard. Simply log in to your CSTA account and then click on the CSTA discussion board dashlet. You can also access the CSTA virtual community on the CSTA website underneath the membership tab. If you have an active CSTA account, you can log in with the same credentials. Let's log in and update your profile. Once you're logged in, you'll be asked to confirm the terms and conditions of using the CSTA virtual community. Once you agree to the terms, go ahead and click the person icon in the upper right hand corner. If you have a profile picture on the CSTA website, you'll see your picture here. Your profile information is what other members of the community can see. We recommend uploading a profile picture if you don't already have one. Your account has some information included from CSTA from your portal that can be edited. Underneath the bio, you can provide a few lines about yourself and your professional history. Underneath connections, you can connect with other members. This tab will also show who you've also been connected with. Under your account, you can adjust your privacy settings to control who sees what information. Under the Email Preferences tab, you'll be able to let the system know what kind of notifications you'd like to receive about the CSTA virtual community. Notifications are available to edit based on the information you'd like to receive from a community that you're involved in. For example, if you're looking to get updates on a thread within a discussion group, you can get updates in by email and then you can respond as well. You can also control how often these are sent. You can see what communities you are a part of by selecting the Community tab and then My Communities on the navigation bar. You can also look at what other communities are available and the open form. This is a space for general CSTA virtual community announcements, like a new community or upcoming events. We will post resources and videos in this space to help support you navigating the new site. Members have been placed into groups based on what's indicated in their member profiles. Some of these groups include the Computer Science Honor Society Advisors, CSTA Chapter Leaders Group, and CSTA Chapter Leaders. Our largest communities will be affiliated with grade bands. If you've noted the grades you teach in your member profile, you will already be in those communities. Here, you'll find active conversations and resource sharing from others teaching CS in your grade bands. We encourage you to visit the site and share some of your favorite classroom resources or respond to someone's post. The more you engage with the community, the more you'll get out of it. Each community page has threaded discussions, a library of resources, and polls. You can participate by creating a new post, responding to a thread, or adding a resource to the library. If your professional role changes, or if you'd like to join a different grade band group, you can simply update your professional role in your member profile and you'll be added to the grade band group within 24 hours. The CSTA virtual community is a space to get what you need. If you're looking for networking opportunities, all of our CSTA members are in the community and available to make connections. If you're looking to exchange resources and collaborate on common challenges, asking questions in a thread is a great place to start. If you're looking to learn how others are using resources in their classroom, we recommend looking in the library and posting a thread on a current post. Whether you're an educator or a computer science advocate, the CSTA virtual community is for you. We've created this resource to help support teachers and help further develop our community. When I was a CS teacher, I craved having a network to bounce ideas off of and collaborate during challenging times. I would have loved to have a virtual space like the CSTA virtual community to get immediate feedback from my CSTA peers. And the best part of it all, the CSTA virtual community is free for all CSTA members. If you already have a profile set up, it's the same login credentials for your CSTA account. The community is a place to connect with members, exchange ideas and resources, and get the support you need. It's the department support you wish you had.